Well, hey friends, welcome to my channel if you are new. My name is Mandy and this is Sweetly Home. We love to talk about all things heart and home here on my channel and today I have a Costco haul for you. This is the largest Costco haul that we have ever done. So we are a family of four and we also run a large kennel of dogs. We currently have 12 and they are competition hunting dogs. So part of this haul includes four large bags of dog food. It also includes some paper products and things that we were out of and those things will last us for several months. And it includes food and some like clothing items and a whole lot of stuff. <laughs> So we tend to do a grocery shop, just a regular grocery shop, once every three weeks. And then we pretty much stay out of the stores unless we are like really dire, desperate out of something. But with my home management, I really try and make sure that that doesn't happen. And we also do a once a month Costco haul. But as I mentioned, we are just out of a lot of things. And in the next couple weeks, there's a possibility that my husband's job will actually be shutting down for a couple weeks, so he will be without pay. So we kind of preempted a lot of that stuff that we knew we would need in the future and just bought it all today. So without further ado, let's get into the Costco haul. Okay, so let's start with the items on the floor. We got a pack of toilet paper, a pack of paper towels, some diapers. My son is potty trained during the day but not yet at night so uh, he still needs some diapers so that will last us for several months. Hopefully hopefully he'll be potty trained at some point and we won't need all of those but we do for now. So um, and then also I picked up a three pack of Ziploc freezer bags. Um, I go through a lot of freezer bags and I did the math today and I compared the price of these Ziploc freezer bags with buying it say at the dollar store and I actually saved money by purchasing these at Costco. Okay so we got some yogurt for my hubby's lunch. My kids will probably snack on this a bit too. They love yogurt. Um, I picked up some plain Greek yogurt. This is the Kirkland brand and um, I always tend to get this as well. This will last us a while. I like to use it in recipes um, and also for Trim Healthy Mama. Some marble cheese mozzarella cheese, two half and half creamers, a bag of the chicken fillets from Kirkland brand. Um, we usually get the chicken breasts, however, I'm finding that um, the fillets just kind of might work a little bit better. A smaller portion of meat and we tend to kind of chop things up anyways to use on uh, salads and sandwiches and different things like that, um, so the fillets might just be a bit better. <clears throat> I also picked up some uh, maple flavored bacon. We love this stuff. It's so good um, and it does come in a two pack. Next I got this organic spring mix and then my if you're familiar with my Costco hauls you know my hubby loves honey bunches of oats and so uh, we've got another box. Um, Malta green Cheerios, two bags of milk, clementines and my trick for these is to always just kind of feel as many as you can because we have actually come across ones that are kind of mushy uh, and you want to get the most bang for your buck. Okay, so we grabbed a bag of frozen blueberries, a big pack of hamburger, ground beef, um, coffee, Kirkland brand coffee, and this is whole bean, um, whole beans, and we just grind them up in our magic bullet. Um, another thing of Ziploc bags, these are the medium freezer bags, and again, the whole price of this pack on sale is cheaper than purchasing them at the dollar store. And then we also did the same thing with the Ziploc um, sandwich bags. I got two packs of bananas, and even though Costco bananas are usually green, um, the way that I kind of am trying to work this is that we'll try and ripen one pack before the other. So sometimes if you stick it with really ripe fruit or if you, I think if you put it in a uh, brown paper bag, they'll also ripen quicker as well. So that's a way that we can kind of stagger the fruit. Um, and then also I do hope to make some banana bread and some other banana goodies with some of these bananas. A big bag of apples and these were gala apples. Love gala apples. A big pack of nan bread. My kiddos love this stuff. And then we needed light bulbs, so these are 60 watt 
light bulbs. And then um, six boxes of baking soda. So we're going to use these, of course, in cooking, but also I use baking soda in some of my cleaning. Okay, so over to this side, we got a big pack of tomatoes, two packs of blackberries, and then Captain Crunch, my hubby, is having some already. Um, three chickens. I'm really anxious to do some chicken broth. Um, and then also to have roast chicken. It's going to be so good. <laughs> um, some avocado oil. So this is one of the things that we were out of, but this will last us for months. So that was kind of the theme with this haul, is some of the things that will that we've picked up will last us for months and not necessarily will be out in a few weeks. So that's one of those items. And same with the salt. We get pink Himalayan sea salt and this will last us for several months as well. This pack of applesauce was a new thing for us. So I usually do like to have applesauce on hand for the kids. Um, I like to get unsweetened applesauce and when I did the math, my buy price is $2 for one of these containers, a six pack. Um, I never get it if it's any more than that because they always go on sale at the grocery store. This pack, I can't remember how much it was off the top of my head, however it was cheaper to get this variety pack than to buy these um, individually at the grocery store. I got four dozen eggs, uh, two containers of sour cream, four pounds of butter, and again with the coffee filters we are almost nearing the end of our coffee filters there are 700 coffee filters in here or is it 600 no, let's, let's just check that yeah 600 okay there's 600 and they were uh, seven dollars the last time i ran out of coffee filters i had to buy them at the drugstore and one pack of 30 cost me almost five dollars <laughs> so um, mama can't go without her coffee so this is gonna last us for so long um, and it's a much better price than having to buy it you know wherever you can find them again we also needed uh, Brita filters and you get eight in a pack and um, again this will last us for a really long time a big huge bag of Nestle semi-sweet morsels so the Kirkland brand was a dollar more and you got the same amount of chips in each bag. So it made more sense to go with the Nestle brand than the Kirkland brand. Got a big bag of onions and two packs of um, tortillas and these are 100% whole grain tortillas and these are ancient grain ones. And then right here I make uh, my own homemade bread so I have two loaves thawing this is uh, organic spelt bread and then this is honey whole wheat okay we also got a 48 pack of double a batteries this will last us forever the last pack of batteries I bought lasted about three years so I don't know sometimes you need double A's and it's just really nice to have them on hand we also got a four pack of shaving cream for my husband and then I love the Kirkland brand uh, makeup removing wipes. Love, love, love them. Again, this pack will last me a couple of months and they're just, they're really great. So then this was kind of um, not on our grocery budget, uh, but we love Crocs and um, they had them for the kids and these were $20 each. So these will go in my kiddo's Easter basket. So these ones are for my daughter and they're really pretty blue it's probably not coming up very well on camera because it's late and dark <laughs> but it's got pink accents and she's gonna love them these are really great for just playing outdoors um, playing in the water and at the lake and all kinds of things so uh, we love crocs for that and then these are the ones for my son Let's see if i can try and get them better so they are navy with aqua accents and white oh my goodness this is like him in a shoe they're so cute and then I got a pair of shoes as well so these are Puma sneakers and they are they're really dark navy with these awesome bottoms I'm so so excited about these and then we also picked up four bags of dog food um, my husband has already put most of them in with our dog food already. 
Um, I always joke that it often feels like we are um, on the movie Christmas Vacation when um, they're at Walmart and uh, Ed keeps putting uh, bags of dog food in the grocery cart because, my goodness, that's kind of what it feels like. We have our own um, kennel of dogs, um, gun dog, gun dogs, um, competition hunting dogs. Uh, so we got four bags of those and then also um, some windshield washer fluid and I think I think it's a two-pack that it comes in but that is our grocery haul or our Costco haul I guess I should say and now I gotta put it all away it is quarter after 11 at night well there you have it thank you so much for watching if you're new to my channel and you enjoy Costco hauls and meal planning and all things house and home feel free to hit that subscribe button we would love to have you here at sweetly home and I just want to wish you all a good day we'll see you in my next video bye